Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. This is another transfer news video. As you can see by the title, according to certain sources, Barnsley have placed a bid on a certain midfielder from the Scottish League. We're going to go into get into details of who that is and how much and all that stuff. Um, but yeah, this is the transfer video where we talk about, obviously, the person Barnes has put a bid on. A bid on, not a vid, a bid. And I'm also going to be doing other transfer videos for anyone else we sell or anyone else we buy. So if you enjoy this video, subscribe. Right then, according to certain sources, the, there is this centre midfielder, 19 years of age, a, from the Scottish League. I do believe it's Motherwell he played for. If I got that wrong, I apologise. Came through their academy, he's 19 year old, and he's got a huge potential. As some sources on the internet quote with it, a wonder kid, but... We'll see about that. Um, David Turnbull, I do believe his name is. Um, Celtic have also put a bid in for him. One source says that we've put two a £2 million bid in and Celtic have put a £1 million bid in. Another source that I read saying Celtic have put a £1 million bid again and we've done a £1.3 million bid, I do believe. But as I said on Sky Sports this morning, that if it is Motherwell, I think that's the team if I get it right that they have put an asking price of £3 million, which is quite a bit of money for a midfielder. But if he's got the potential that everyone's making out, and all their fans are making out, it might be a good buy. I've not seen anything of him. He's an attacking midfielder, I do believe. Scored 15 or 16 goals this year, which is good for a midfielder in the Scottish League. And something I read earlier is Celtic, as you know, win back-to-back -back titles every year. With the teams such as Rangers and Aberdeen putting a bit of a challenge, but never really seem to challenge them. So yeah, any young kids that are coming through the rankings in the Scottish League, Celtic are always known to snap them up like that because they don't want any other teams to get them. So other teams can't develop and then challenge Celtic for the title. So like I say, Celtic wouldn't be putting a bid for him if he wasn't anything special. So I do believe we've got a target on a decent young kid as it looks. Like I say, he's 19 years of age, so he's another young addition to our team, like I say. Which, as you know, we only go for young players. There's going to be a video out after this about another player that we're also linked with. But yeah, David Turnbull, 19-year-old from Motherwell, apparently put a bid in. They want £3 million. Um, Obviously, you'll have your scouts and all that that know how good he is. I can't really comment because I don't know how good he is. I don't know if three mil would be worth it or not. Looking at our team depth, we've got our two midfielders, Amawa and McGeehan. On the bench, we've got Dougal, who is a central midfielder or a holding midfielder, and attacking midfielder-wise, we've got Barry on the bench. So, another attacking midfielder. Depends how versatile he is. Can he go out wide? Can he nip up front if we need it? Can he replace in centre mid if need be? Depends how versatile he is. And if he's got potential, it might be a worthy buy. If he's good as people make it out, and if he's not just an attacking mid, like I say, if he's versatile, if he can go out wide, if he can drop back, if he can go up front, I think it'll be a good purchase. I did just say I was going to do this other transfer rumour in another video, but I'm going to squeeze it into this video instead of making two videos. Uh, it is the centre-back from the Scottish League as well, Jason Kerr, I think, I think his name's first name Jason Summit, Summit Kerr, a centre-back from, I think it's Inverness. I apologise if I got that wrong as well, but it's one of the clubs in the Scottish leagues, in the Scottish divisions. Yeah, second name's Kerr. A couple of other championship teams have been linked with him. We've been linked with him. I don't know if that's because Lindy's meant to be leaving, because apparently someone's put from the Italian league, someone's put a bid in for Lindsay, so I don't know if we're linked with this Kerr, because... Lindsay's set to leave, or if he's going to be the replacement for Jackson on the bench, which would be good. He's meant to be a good young centre-back as well. He's young as well. I don't think he's that old. I think he might be 19 as well. I'm not sure. He's a good centre-back, solid centre-back, got potential, just like this turn ball that we're after. So, yeah, we've got two good players that we're linked with, if we get them or not. We have also been linked with that something Englis, Inglis from FC Roda. But he's gone aside for some Swedish team. So that is out of the window. So they're the two. The two ones we've been linked with. 
David Turnbull and attacking centre mid scored over 15 or 16 goals in the Scottish Premier League. That's it's got to be a good record, surely, for Premier League, for the Scottish Premier League, and also the centre back from Inverness, Jason Kerr. Um, it'd be nice to keep Lindsay and get that centre back. And then we've got three strong centre backs for the um, Championship to rotate. Because it's a lot harder in the Championship and Pinnock and Lindsay might not be able to play as consistently as they did last season, which last season was amazing. And we have lost three or four players off the bench, losing your types of hedges. Your Jackson's off the bench, he needs replacing. Isgrove, Friars and somebody else went. I forgot who it was. But they were all bench players and we need to replace them all. So yeah, let me know your thoughts on them. If you're new, subscribe. I want to reach 1.3k before the season starts. The fixtures come out in just over two weeks, I do believe. So stay tuned for them. I'll be doing the league prediction and all that stuff. So yeah, if you made it this far, you're a legend. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.